the best examples of DAOs. There's a lot of hype around decentralized autonomous organizations or DAOs as a key element of the metaverse and Web3. So let's look at the best practical examples of DAOs in existence today. So just to recap, a decentralized autonomous organization or a DAO is a Web3 idea that allows communities, corporations or any type of collective organization to be administered and governed without centralized leadership thanks to the ability of blockchain. Blockchains like Ethereum allow the creation of smart contracts, essentially sets of rules to be implemented in a secure way that can then be used to govern organizations. So here are my favorite examples. Uniswap, which is one of the biggest and most popular DAOs. It operates as a cryptocurrency exchange built on the Ethereum blockchain. Anyone can become a member by holding the UNI token, which gives voting rights to the way the organization is run and administered. The DAO. This is one that was not a huge success. Uh, the DAO was one of the earliest attempts to build a decentralized financial or DeFi for short network for crowdfunding venture capital. Unfortunately, it was hacked, resulting in the theft of $60 million worth of Ethereum token. This theft was controversially reversed and the funds were returned to their rightful owners through a process known as forking. Decentraland. This is an online virtual world governed by a DAO, um, where administrative and governance decisions are taken by the stakeholders in a democratic fashion. Anyone who owns the platform's token, known as MANA, can take part in the process. And the platform is quickly becoming popular with global brands, including Morgan Stanley, Coca-Cola and Adidas, as a way of reaching out to digital and native audiences. American Crypto Fat DAO, which made news headlines by becoming the first to be recognized as a legal entity in the US thanks to a law passed in the Web3 friendly state of Wyoming. It positions itself as a kind of crypto equivalent of the US Federal Reserve and aims to enable fee-free trading using its own token known as Ducat. BitDAO this is a decentralized investment fund backed by PayPal founder Peter Thiel, created to allow anyone to buy a stake in Web3 and DeFi startups and initiatives. Token holders have the chance to vote on how managed capital is spread across the project supported by the fund. LexDAO, this is a DAO that aims to create smart contracts capable of carrying out legal services. It is headquartered in the crypto voxel metaverse platform and is concerned with building blockchain tools that can automate aspects of legal services, including arbitration. With many DAOs existing in the gray area of legality, services like this may become essential in the future. Friends with Benefit, which is a crypto club where owners of the FWB token can meet to network and collaborate on individual projects. They are individual hubs for different cities, so users can meet up with similarly Web3 minded individuals in their own locality. The more FWB tokens a user holds, the more interaction and opportunities to connect become available. Constitution DAO, which was set up in 2021 as a decentralized crowdfunded effort to win a rare edition of the US Constitution put up for auction by Sotheby's. Ultimately, despite raising over $40 million from over 50,000 contributors, it wasn't able to win the auction. However, the organizer stated that even though they didn't win the bid, the project was a success in that it had educated many people on the potential of DAOs as a vehicle for raising crowdsourced funds. 
Pleaser, which is a collective of artists and art lovers that invest in NFT artwork and other digital collectibles. It focuses on pieces that its members believe represent important ideas and causes and it experiments with the idea of fractional ownership of art as all members have a share in the growing collection. Ukraine DAO, which is a fundraising DAO set up to collect and distribute donations to assist those affected by the war in Ukraine. Among its successes were the auctioning of an NFT image of the Ukrainian flag, which sold for 2,258 ethers or $4.7 million. So this is all a super exciting feel to stay on top of the latest Web3 trends, subscribe to my channel or have a look at my book Business Trends in Practice, which just won the best business book of the year 2022.